Hey, what's up YouTube? Bike Spike again. Just wanted to show you guys a couple of plastic containers I've been using for my sneakers. Uh, I, I think I finally found the right one, but let's just start with the first couple ones that I found. Uh, the first one right here. Uh, this one just kind of sucks. It's really cheap though. You can get it at any of your local department stores. Uh, I think it probably comes up to 3 or $4 max. Really cheap box. It only fits low cut sneakers though. That's the bad thing about them. Also use a box of these for um, insoles, inserts, midsoles, whatever you want to call it. There it is. The second one I started using was this giant one right here. Let me just grab one right here. This one, it fits high cut, slow cuts, and um, really nicely, but the only downside to these, I just have a bunch of crap in here. Out of the way. Only downside to these, this box doesn't breathe. Like when you take your sneakers out, it has a really funky smell to it. But it does stack really nicely, locks up really nice as well. So the next box I got for you, this is the best box so far I've ever used. Uh, it's a little pricey. I think it comes up to about nine bucks per box if you find it for a good deal. Uh, I seen it on Amazon and there was a six pack deal. So as you can see right here, it's a drop-in box from Iris. Uh, on the information or the description, it says it can only fit up to size 11 or even a 10. But uh, this is the large box and it fits my size 12 shoes perfectly. And I have more on the way. So as you can see right here, you can display your boxes really nicely. Uh, let's just take a quick look from the side. It is a little blurred out. Really nice, stacks really well. And the shoes, or uh, let's take a look on the inside actually. There's a hole on the bottom of each box and it breathes really nicely. So it doesn't have that funky smell. So uh, as you can see right here, some shoes it might not fit perfectly, but you just gotta turn it a little bit and then it'll come up properly. You can also put it sideways. Let me just pull this one out right here. Put it sideways like this, and then you'll be able to see your shoes from the side view. Like that, it'll click back in, and there you go. Or you can see it from the side view. I prefer the side view like this rather than the sole itself. But uh, here we are. This is the Iris large drop in box. And uh, here's just a quick look at the rest of my setup just a bunch of uh, uh, literature I like to read. There's a couple sneaker books in there as well. Soul Provider, Soul Sneakers Complete Collector's Edition. Some random socks I got from a friend of mine. He picked this up in Japan, the Royals. Uh, elite socks. And uh, apparently KFC gives out toys in China. My girlfriend picked this up for me. So uh, anyway, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to show you guys uh, these awesome boxes definitely go check it out if you have a smaller feet I believe they have a smaller box as well I uh, it's just really nice that you can just open the latch close it and then uh, go in and out quick time and then uh, without looking at through every single one of your boxes which is quite hectic if you're trying to decide every morning but uh, that's pretty much it hope you guys enjoyed this quick video stay tuned to more videos from my channel uh, subscribe and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.